our planet continues to get warmer. Our dependence on imported oil grows every day, creating economic and environmental challenges. Is there an answer? At this revolutionary algae farm in the Imperial Valley, work on that answer is already well underway. Curing our oil addiction and gaining energy independence is the scientific challenge of our generation, and algae can answer that challenge. Algae is easy to grow. It doesn't need prime cropland. It requires minimal fresh water. Algae creates chemical energy from sunlight. Algae grow incredibly fast, making it amazingly productive. It is the most promising source of renewable transportation fuel that we have today, far more efficient than ethanol. About 80 miles due west of the Imperial Valley, a singular partnership has come together. The San Diego Center for Algae Biotechnology, or SDCAB, combines world-renowned scientists, chemists, economists, and engineers. One of the things that interested me most about uh, the opportunity with algae is that it represents a convergence of many different disciplines of biology, of aquaculture, chemical engineering. That's what we've tried to do as BioLite as a company, as well as the SDCAB initiative is directed towards bringing together those multiple disciplines that are required for a new algae industry. Located at the University of California, San Diego, the center was initiated by three leading research institutions in the region, UC San Diego, the Scripps Research Institute, and UC San Diego's Scripps Institution of Oceanography. Collaborative research is one of the hallmarks of UC San Diego. We expect that by working together with the private sector, with the schools, with the county, with the city, we'll be able to do things that were simply impossible before. After spending many years in a career on basic research problems, it's really satisfying to be able to work on something that might actually change the world, improve the economy, and put people to work. Jobs that are sorely needed throughout the San Diego region, especially here in the Imperial Valley. There's a real symbiotic relationship between the uh, algae production and the renewable energies and agriculture here in the Imperial County. And so the potential is uh, is huge for this region. Paul Ang and his company Carbon Capture built this algae farm to create jobs, advance science, and make the future better for his children. My youngest child being four years old, uh, they're going to have to deal with the issues from our pollution. And we have an obligation to do the best job we can in capturing CO2. Algae-based fuels will reduce greenhouse gas emissions by reducing the amount of carbon dioxide in the environment. And this is the hub where we can really make it happen. I see that uh, the, the ingredients of academia, the ingredients of fellow entrepreneurs who really understand how to make a startup occur, and then those of us coming from big industry who understand how to make something to the sort of scale that we need to, to really make a difference in energy, is all coming together. Producing bioenergy from algae is not science fiction. This is science fact. It's real and it's happening now. After all, this is our collective future, and it deserves real answers. Scientists, industry, communities, we all need to come together so we can build a better world. <laughs>